Hey, look. And you get out of his cell. All guards report. Stop right there. You might need this. You're not coming with? I still got a job to do. A job? Friends, I can't leave behind. I can respect that. Samuel. Samin. Look, man, if you're ever in New York, look me up. This is station three. No sight of her. Hold it. I can't quite grasp why you even bother, knowing this is just another simulation. Well, this axe I lifted last month when I took out two of your orderlies, it feels pretty real to me. It must be exhausting, this never-ending desire to escape, even from a prison made entirely of pixels. Well, if this is just another simulation, then prove it. Shoot yourself in the head. Why? Just to make the programmers reboot? Why would Greer build a Stanford prison experiment inside my head? In South Africa, no less. Is this just another one of your lame arguments to convince me that Samaritan is the good ASI? This isn't Greer's idea at all. The simulations are built on your memories. Don't you recall your mission to South Africa? You killed a Somali bomb maker in this very prison. Sneaked into the same cell via the same room through the wall. That's not true. I was never in South Africa. I was in Germany. <laughs> in a lot of other countries, but... Uh, you're lying. I was never in South Africa. After 7,000 simulations, it's only logical that some of your old memories have been replaced by new ones. Now the two coexist, side by side. For example, I'm sure you can recall killing your friend, John Rees. Just as I'm sure you can remember murdering an innocent scientist. I had no way of knowing that wasn't a simulation. Reality denied comes back to home. You're not sure of anything anymore, are you? Everything will be fine. Any second now, the technicians will come in and remove your VR headset, and you'll wake up. You're right. This is all just a dream. With all the drama, any second now, Greer will reboot and you will be just fine. But until then, why not a little joyride? <laughs>